Good morning, you guys. I just did my whole little skincare routine and did some ice rolling on my face. I feel so much better and more like hydrated, but I think I wanna make a little espresso drink. So let's do that and then we'll talk about today. So this morning's drink is literally just espresso and then a little bit of this Dolce de Leche skinny syrup. And I feel like that just makes the shot of espresso a little bit more doable. It is really nice out today, which is good, but I'm just like so in the mood for fall. So when it's hot out again, I'm just like sad, but I need to get over that because I'm going to miss these warm days once winter hits. So I got to be better about living in the moment and appreciating the weather while we have it. Um, but today is Wednesday, right? Or is it Tuesday? What is today? I'm confused now. Okay, I figured out the day. Today is Tuesday. <laughs> I don't know why this whole week, it's literally only Tuesday, but this whole week has felt so like long. I'm like, ugh. But I'm excited because I have this Friday off because I'm going up north with my friends. So get ready for that vlog. It's gonna be so fun. It's called the Fall Ride, which I've never been to before, but apparently it's like all these people drive their motorcycles up there and like there's like a festival and everyone goes out to the bars basically me and the girlies are going just to go to the bars but i'm excited for it so get ready for that vlog it's gonna be so fun and i just love hanging out with the girls i haven't i feel like we haven't all hung out together in quite a while so that should be really nice but anyways today is tuesday yesterday was monday that's how the week works guys i don't know if you knew that but <laughs> <laughs> yesterday we went to matcha's little puppy kindergarten and i feel like for the first class it went really really well she was so good but she was really scared during like the puppy play time they split us into two different groups so it was like small dogs and big dogs and matcha was in the small dog group and <laughs> the other two puppies were having so much fun playing with each other and she was just like kind of sitting in the corner watching and you could she's also playing with a donut toy right now you could tell Matcha like wanted to go and play with the other dogs, but she was just like unsure. So I think next week, hopefully she'll be like a little bit more comfy since it's not going to be like a brand new place and hopefully she'll want to play with everyone. But she was doing so good with all the little tricks and everyone was like so obsessed with her as they should be. She's adorable. Sophie is trying to lick all the skincare I just applied. That's for mama. Also, I think I've already talked about this bracelet like 30 times. I have been obsessed with this Italian charm bracelet. It's so cute. It literally gives me like nostalgia vibes in a weird way because I'm being brave setting my espresso on the edge of this bed. It like pinches your skin if it like opens and closes. Ow, like I just did. So I literally remember that pinching feeling when I was little and how painful it was. Also, I don't remember, but I feel like my parents must have been the ones to make this for me when I was little because it is so hard to put together and I don't know how I would have done that as a child. It was like taking me so long and I had to take off my nails and have short nails in order to put it together. So I don't even think I could change it now with these nails and these nails aren't even that long. So I'll have to ask my mom or mom if you're watching this, do you remember this? And did you put it together for me when I was little, the Italian charm bracelets? Cause this was so hard to do. But anyways, another really exciting thing. I'm just in a chatty mood this morning, so sorry about that. Another really exciting thing is, obviously I'm wearing Jerf Avenue pajamas and they just came in stock again. So I ordered one of the Jerf Avenue t-shirt pajama things and I ordered it in a super big size. So I'm hoping it's long enough to wear as like a little nighty. But if not, I'll still wear it with the matching pants and shorts I already have. And then I finally was able to get the like fruit print shirt i have the shorts and pants in the fruit print but i don't have like this like long sleeve shirt yet so i'm so excited to have that because now i have the full sets although they had a pop-up shop in new york city a couple days ago and they released like a new york exclusive pajama like print and it's like baby pink color and then it has these like really cute little designs on it and I want it so bad <laughs> and they're all sold out on the site, obviously. So I might keep an eye out. I don't know if they're planning on restocking it since it was New York exclusive. I have a feeling they're not. Um, so maybe I'll have to keep an eye out if anybody resells them, but I have a feeling they'll resell them for a crazy amount. But anyways, I'm a Jerf Avenue girly. I'm obsessed with them. And I'm just so happy that now I have finally all the pieces I've been wanting in the sets that they have available. <laughs> 
But anyways, I should probably get dressed so I can start my little work from home day. Even though I work from home, I try to make it a habit to actually get dressed every day so I don't feel like I fall into the habit of staying in my pajamas all day. Although these are cute enough, I would be okay with staying in them, but I feel like for my mental health, <laughs> I need to like actually get ready every day. I wanted to do my makeup today, but I feel like I might just let my skin breathe because I don't have anything planned. So may as well not put makeup on just to sit at home, I guess. Anyways, let's find an outfit and then I'll start my work from home day. Okay, you guys. <laughs> so remember this morning, which was like two seconds ago for you guys, when I was like, let's get an outfit and we'll work from home. Yeah, I didn't put on an outfit. I did stay in my PJs. That's okay. You know, it happens. <laughs> but I just finished up my work from home day and I got a email notification that two of the items I have like brand deals for just arrived and they came early. So now I do want to do my makeup because I have to film one of them and send it over to the company for approval before I can post them on TikTok and on Flip, which is the app that I'm doing it for. So I kind of want to get that done now because I just want to get it filmed and sent over for approval so then I can get it posted as soon as possible for the brand. So I'm excited. This is like my first paid campaign with a brand, which is so freaking cool and I'm so grateful. All the other campaigns I've done before are either like affiliate, so I get paid if someone else buys something, or they're gifted campaigns, so a company will send me something and it basically I write a review or I make a video reviewing them. But for this one, they're sending me things and I'm actually getting paid for the content I'm making. So like, so cool, I'm so excited. Let's grab the package from the front door, then we'll start doing our makeup. I think I wanna just do like a natural glowy look, like one of my normal go-to look. And then we actually need to find some clothes cause I can't really film a brand deal wearing pajamas, at least not for these products. <laughs> I am so excited. All my fave little products out. These are what I'm gonna use to get ready. So while I do my makeup today, I'm gonna listen to Olivia Rodrigo's new album. I've been actually obsessed with it. And if you guys know me or listen to my like channel, I don't listen to music. I only listen to podcasts. So the fact that I like an album is saying a lot. So anyways, gonna listen to this while I do my makeup. Such bad hiccups right now. Okay, remember when I said I was gonna do a natural look? Um, she has a full face on, um, but I think it looks cute, so I'm down, and honestly, it's okay with me, because if I'm filming a brand deal, I wanna look cute in it, obviously. These lashes are crazy. I use those Kiss Impress No Glue Press on lashes again. But anyways, now that this is done, I think I want to put on a cute fall fit, and then we're gonna film the unboxings, and then I'll film my brand deals. I'm so excited. You guys, I feel like I just unlocked the cutest fit ever. First of all, I did two little high ponies with those little bows from Amazon. I am obsessed with this hairstyle. I feel like it's so cute. And then look at this outfit. These little cargo pants, a little cropped, a striped sweater, this little tan vest, and then my Ugg Tasman's. 
Is this not the most cute, like, neutral fall fit? I'm obsessed with it. Let's film these unboxings. I feel like as soon as I put on a cute outfit, like everything in life just feels better. Just finished filming and editing those brand deals. So I got those sent over for approval. So weird and so cool. First time I've ever had to do that. Now it's literally almost five already. So my whole afternoon got away from me, but that's okay. I'm gonna hang outside with the girlies for a little bit. And then hopefully by then my mail will be here. I don't know why my mail gets here so late. Cause I know there's a couple more packages for that brand deal in there so just waiting on those we just finished doing the puppies a little homework from puppy kindergarten but now we're going on a walk and i'm wearing these cute pink cargo pants i got from american anyways as i was saying before rudely interrupted i'm wearing these pink cargo pants from american eagle and they're very cute and they're very comfy and they're very weird because they're not neutral but they're still like light pink so they're neutral enough and we just got back from our walk Mm. and yeah anyways i'm probably gonna end the vlog here thanks so much for watching if you liked it make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next one bye guys <laughs>